Hey guys, so I decided to make a little update because, as always, I've kind of been not very good at posting videos, um, mostly because of school. Right now I have exams about to start, and I've had a ton of assignments due lately, which has just been so much fun. Um, but I've still been getting all my workouts in and everything. But there's some things I'm going to update you on if you care to listen. So first of all, um, I was trying to do a cut, or I've been trying to do a cut for a while now. Um, but I wasn't losing any weight. Um, my weight was basically staying the same, even though I was lowering my macros and increasing cardio like crazy. So... I got blood work done to see if I had anything wrong with me and um, we thought I had hypothyroidism but it turns out that my thyroid is apparently fine so I'm now kind of confused as to what is wrong with me exactly but um, I'm just sort of thinking now that maybe it's to do with stress with school and I haven't really been sleeping a lot so that's probably not helping. Um, so yeah, basically kind of motivated me to work harder at the gym because I feel like maybe I'm doing something wrong. Um, so yeah, my legs today are like dying from cardio. Um, walking to classes is like painful because I don't usually run on the treadmill and lately I've been doing that instead of the bike because normally, um, my shins start to hurt when I do the treadmill too much. So I'm trying to like alternate between the two, treadmill and the bike, because I do like the exercise bike a lot, but I get bored of it after a while. Um, so yeah, I'm trying to make my cardio more interesting. Um, yeah, that's about it. That's like the main change that I've made. Um, so I hope that works. And I hope start to lose some weight a little bit. And yeah, so I'll update you on that in a little bit. Um, more recently, what's happened today? Um, well, I tried to find my protein today that I always use. Uh, Molten Chocolate by Cellicor. That's like the one I use every day in my breakfast. So I go through like a ton of it. And I had a four pound tub, but... I just ran out, so I went to two different stores today, and both of them do not have the protein powder. I was kind of annoyed with that, and I gave up after the second store, so I'm just going to wait until they get it in and then go back um, in one or two days. So, don't know what I'm going to eat for breakfast. If you, I don't know if you're like me and you have your like specific meal you eat every day. It's really hard to change from that, but yeah. Um, I guess I'll have to make do. Um, and then another thing is lately I've been doing a whole lot of, um, stress bacon, baking, it's not about the bacon, sorry, um, because, uh, exams just bring that out in me. I end up baking to procrastinate, or, like today, I make a video to procrastinate, <laughs> um, but, like, I don't know. I just have a tendency to bake when I'm stressed out. And, yeah, I guess that's good for other people because I post a lot of recipes on my Instagram. But, um, yeah, I tend to waste a lot of time. <laughs> um, yeah. So I need to get that under control. Plus, that's another reason I'm out of protein powder is that I've used it all up and, like, 10,000 baked things and half the time they don't even work out and I just have all these frozen baked things that are semi good but yeah um and lastly another thing I'm really excited about is I ordered a new pre-workout and I have not been taking pre-workout at all I haven't like maybe on the odd occasion I take a couple scoops of C4 but really that doesn't do anything for me I don't know why but um, not really affected by it. I'll take two scoops and I don't feel anything. 
So I tried to look up a really good pre-workout, one with more caffeine, because I'm not very caffeine sensitive. So I ended up finding um, Chaos and Pain's Cannibal Ferox, and I ordered the AMP version. Um, ordered AMP because it does not ca contain Yohimbine, which I looked up and found out that Canada has some regulations about it and it's harder to get it here. So I didn't order that kind, but apparently I could have, which I'm really frustrated, I could have ordered the original Cannibal Ferox, which I wanted to try. So next time, if I do like the AMP version, I might order the original. But still, I am excited to try this one I ordered. It's loaded with caffeine. I can't remember how much, like 400 something milligrams. <laughs> but I don't plan on taking a full scoop right away. But it has a lot of other ingredients that looked really good. And it had amazing reviews. It's not a super popular company. But that's what I kind of liked about it. I'm tired of trying all the big brand names and they just don't end up working the way I want them to. So I decided I'm going to start trying some like lesser known pro er, pre-workouts. And surprisingly, people have compared this one to Craze. And they say it could be just as good. Which is surprising because I know Craze was taken off a few years ago because of some... Um, interesting ingredients, let's just say. Uh, <laughs> but yeah, this does not contain the same ingredients as Craze, but it has been compared to be just as good when it comes to focus and energy. So yeah, really excited about that. I should get that in about six or seven days, I think. Maybe less because they actually ship faster than I thought they would. Um, but yeah, that's what I'm really excited for. And what else? Oh, I also would love to post more videos and I want to post like eating videos or just videos of my food or full day of eating, something like that. But I'm waiting till exams finish to do this because again, I don't want to um, take away from my studying, which I'm already really bad for. So, um, I will do that probably after April 27th, which is my last exam, or a little bit after because I'm taking CPR course after that, and then hopefully getting personal training certification, so I'm really excited about all this, but that's what's going on in my life at the moment. I hope you enjoyed this little update, and yeah. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.